I would describe myself as a curious, stubborn individual. I travel the world working at laboratories to create new ways that we can interface with the world around us. Where I am at is um, the intersection of fashion design, of engineering, of science. And what I do is like interweave all these disciplines and take from every discipline in order to explore new possibilities. Basically, I create interactive garments. The signs that do just a little bit more than being pretty. When I studied fashion design, it was much more about, yeah, just the aesthetics rather than the emotional or the psychological side. I rather see the garments that we wear as a really honest opinion, an honest way of communication. For example, I have a smoke dress. As soon as you approach the dress, it starts to smoke. But that's a question about personal space. Mostly we don't tell if somebody's too close to us. Another dress of mine, if you walk up to it, it it's, yeah, really attacks you. I became the way I am because I have never respected the status quo. Really follow whatever your heart is giving you in rather than whatever your society is telling you to do. That goes far beyond money or materialistic stuff. And that will always be my passion and my drive. One of the difficulties that we have is visualizing things that are happening in the body. Because you can visualize it easily like it's being notified. I don't see a breakthrough moment as the final result. I see a breakthrough moment as the starting point for a discussion. What I know from martial arts is that you need to reach your goal, but you're actually slamming for something that is far beyond your target. Above and beyond means to me actually going much further than you, you ever imagined. 